من الناير حكينا من بعيد ومن قريب وكان ساعات I want to say to Mrs. Minister, Ministry of Women, who is here from Tunisia, and uh, she confirmed her attendance. Maybe she was busy today. We understand first day of CSW 63. But we thank her anyway. We thank the Ambassador of Tunisia to the United Nations, His Excellency Mr. Semi. Bugasha, who also confirmed his attendance, but I see that he couldn't make it, maybe? Who knows? Um, estimated delegates, guests, media. My name is Naimar Medinur. I'm the founder and president of the NGO, Arab African American Women's Leadership Council. It's here. It was born in 2009 to empower gender and for leadership, especially for youth. We do have a mascot young boy today. He's 15 years old. It's his third time participating to the uh, CSW 63. This is to show that we don't have discrimination. And he did send this mascot. This boy, Hine. This beautiful uh, caricature of the UN headquarters. So, um, I mentioned that our painters take charge of themselves and their expenses when exhibiting for the Women's Day and we thank them for that. That shows how much it is important for them to be present and active in this gathering. Dear uh, Madame Marie-Claire Bouleau, uh, she is coming from France with uh, Thierry Bonifa, her, uh, uh, yes, her husband, and her children and grandchildren. And we thank them for that. Thank you very much. Dear Emira uh, Trabetsi, coming from Tunisia with her husband, also from Tunisia. Thank you very much. It is a long trip, it is a lot of sacrifice, a lot of money spent for them to be here today. The 21st century have seen a feminine leadership never witnessed before, especially among women and girls. Thanks to the United Nations platform launching great agenda and thinking globally, we today pledge on reaching the Sustainable Development Goal by 2030. Today our NGO choose art. Art and art works because art is the universal language of communication. It allows people to be free of discrimination, color, religion, race, gender, or any geographic border. Today we welcome France, our ally, forever with Tunisia. Together we believe in women's rights, equality, freedom. Vive la France, vive la Tunisie, and God bless America. Thank you. The floor is for Mrs. Marie-Claire Puno. Please come. Rien, venir, madame. Marie-Claire Puno. Avec euh, tout ce que ça comporte de complexité, je suis assez féministe. Donc, euh, elles sont très belles, ces femmes. Je pense que pour être très belles personnes, elles ont dû lutter quelque part au fil des générations. 
Euh, J'ai fait quand même un petit texte sur, le... oui. sur la condition féminine. Ça va aller très vite. Si vous permettez, je peux le traduire. Oui. Can I translate? You know what she's speaking to you. Concernant la condition féminine, je, je pense que celle-ci évolue, mais il y a encore beaucoup de chemin à parcourir. It evolves, but there is a lot to do more. Nous constatons chaque jour ces inégalités de par le monde. We notice every day inequalities all over the world. Tant au niveau du monde du travail, de la politique, et de la famille. In the world, in the politics, and even in the families, inside the families. Pourtant, je constate par ma famille, but I noticed uh, through my family que la génération des hommes s'implique davantage dans ce domaine. That uh, men's world is much more involved uh, into empowering women. Est-ce nous les femmes dans l'éducation que nous donnons à nos enfants faisons entrer cette notion d'inégalité et bousculons les idées reçues de l'ancienne génération? Indeed, it is our fault, women, to spoil boys and make them you know, feel that they are, uh, there is inequality. And so we have to adjust that. Uh, yes. Thank you. Uh, And these little women you see are very powerful to impose their qualities with men. And I'm very proud to be a feminine agent. My name is Amira Trabensi. I'm a professional artist in Tunisia. I've been in many, many uh, international fairs and national fairs in Tunisia. She started being an artist uh, 15 years old. She was 15 years old. Uh, she participated with the famous painter, Tunisian painters in Tunisia and abroad. Is 
our uh, ambassador, honorary ambassador. She is uh, an inspiration. She is a very powerful woman. She is American Algerian. I'm from American Tunisian. So now she's going to speak English. She doesn't need yes. us. <laughs> I have a little introduction. Um, good evening, um, good evening, everyone. My name is Noelle Mary, and I'm originally from Algeria. Um, it's a huge privilege uh, to be here this evening with you all. A warm thank you to Naima Noor, who gave me this opportunity to be here and to be the honorary president of the Arab African American Women Leadership Council. The purpose of this organization is to empower women and for the purpose of human rights and equality. And today, we are empowering women through art and we have among us these amazing women painters. Amirat Abdelsi from Tunisia, Marie-Claire Oumo from France, and others that couldn't attend but are inspiring us with their astonishing paintings. These amazing women speak their minds through their artistic abilities. Because we are celebrating Women's International Day, I would like to send a message to every woman here and abroad. A woman should never wait to be given power. She must take it in any way. Yes. Excuse me, I have to read a message sent by Bilal Karamenti, who is a 15 years old boy. He's a caricaturist, and he sent me a message to read to all of you. Merci beaucoup d'avoir 
Je lirai aussi le message de Guilhem, tandis que mon, ma chère amie Jinja euh, vous fait voir ses caricatures. beauty. 
She is as beautiful as her artwork. She works with a knife. She works on canvas with oil. And she is inspired by all the people of Tunisia, the souks, the light and the dark and the colors. She loves to play with colors and she loves to express her personality through, for example, this beautiful artwork. I love it. It looks a lot like something we can see, see through far, far away from. It's beautiful. Thank you so much. Now, I would like to call my husband, Dr. Noor, and thank him for being there all the time for me, for all women, and encourage me, and travel with me all the time, and do the best to make this a reality. Thank you, Ami. I love you very much. Nice uh, opportunity here to see all these faces. You know, we saw that some of them were so us here. But, uh, and, uh, I, think, I thank the ladies and congratulate them for their yearly event, yearly event. And I'm uh, hoping for uh, them to get more powerful and more effective <laughs> the society and effective also the husbands. <laughs> and, uh, I uh, really appreciate this kind of art here, you know. And I think ladies are made for art, and art is made for ladies. Yeah. What about uh, men? <laughs> men appreciate it, and then they pay for it. <laughs> okay, and thank you very much, and thank you to the people from New York, and the people over to see us, and the people from Tampa, Florida, that came up came to see us, and... Uh, I hope everything you have a good time here. And uh, thank you for the artists, you know, and the people coming from Paris, and people coming from Tunis, and the uh, lady from Algeria. I you know, appreciate our effort here to this event. And uh, thank you for, thank for my wife, you know, she's you know, doing all the work and it's, you know, very, you know, subsidiary, you know. No. <laughs> That's 
for Bilel, Bilel Ramedi. This one is for Hanit Shebi, she's not here, she's our intern, she did a lot, a lot, a lot with Ariana Doka, and she's going to be with us Wednesday, I think, or Friday, so that's her appreciation certificate as well. I want to say something, I swear, I swear God, I think one for my husband, but he's not me. <laughs> I can't find him. Um, I would like uh, Marie Claire to have one certificate for uh, the ambassador of France, because we uh, prepared one. He did not come, he apologized. His name is uh, Excellency Francois de Lac. So we remitted to uh, uh, Madame uh, Marie-Claire Hombo. She may or to uh, Thierry Bonnefoy, please come in. Yes? And you will give it to the ambassador. You will give it to His Excellency, the ambassador of France. So vous dormez et vous vous faites prendre en caméra pour le film comme ça. De rien, de bêtises, I think. I made one for you, honey, but I didn't agree. Thank you very much, all. The buffet is open. If you want to talk to the artists, you can have, they have the mic. They will go through uh, the painting, explain a lot. I want to thank you all for coming, especially Hasib. Especially, <laughs> thank you, uh, Ginger and her uh, Carlos and Mrs. Uh, Fatima Hassan. To all of you, you have done our day. Welcome. Of course. Of course. How can I? How can I forget this day? This is like the building of the United Nations. This woman has built one, the biggest part of the NGOs in the United Nations. Indy, please. Oh, yes. thank you for being here for you. Me, of course. I'm here for you ever. Oh. I think that art is the best expression to peace. And you have given it many times. It's my mari. Et ça c'est Marie-Claire, c'est l'artiste, la peintre de, de, de France, ça c'est Elmira, elle est l'artiste tunisienne, ça c'est Ariane Nandoka, c'est mon affaire, Nawal Améry, vous me connaissez Super, oh là là, je voulais passer plus que vous, mais non, impossible, impossible, notre... alors on, on vous invite pour un buffet, s'il vous plaît, maintenant. Oh, okay. 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 Oh, <laughs> this is my uh, technique, uh, uh, 3D, mm -hmm. uh, my peinture is oil, it's a painting on oil, on oil, it's a painting on 3D, I like to put the painting on What language are you saying? Uh, France. Oh, you say France? Yeah. Ah, okay. okay. Um, J'aime bien de mettre des, des, des effets en 3D, si, si avec le, le papier, si avec le, les toiles, si avec euh, les pattes. En général, j'aime le 3D pour mettre ici. Et euh, 
c'est la Médina en Tunis. Mm -hmm. J'adore les Médina et les portes en bleu, c'est Sidi Bou Saïd. Et la femme avec le Sefseri et la vie qui est associée. Mm -hmm. C'est la liberté de la femme. C'est la femme Gerbia, une Tunisienne. Une Tunisienne, la femme Gerbia qui porte des, euh, des vêtements comme ça et des, euh, des faux bijoux, des, euh, des articles en or. C'est du papier, c'est euh, de la feuille d'or. Ça, c'est le Médina, Tunis. Et la femme avec euh, cette série, euh, toujours avec cette série. J'adore les couleurs, je vais mettre les couleurs ici euh, plus vives pour éclairer le tableau. Et euh, la technique c'est peinture à l'huile sur toile. Ça c'est euh, ma préférée. C'est un tableau que j'adore. C'est du peinture à l'huile sur toile et avec feuilles d'or. Et euh, il m'inspire de la liberté de la femme et, euh, et de la souplesse de la femme et la beauté de la femme. Je m'appelle Marie-Claire Rumeau, je Je suis née en France, habite en France. Et euh, bah, je veux présenter un petit peu mes peintures. Déjà, j'ai commencé à peindre il y a un peu plus de 20 ans. Je suis euh, autodidacte et euh, j'ai choisi le thème de la femme euh, parce que c'est un thème qui m'était un petit peu cher, hein, vu que je suis assez euh, féministe et je prends souvent la défense des femmes. Donc si vous avez un panel assez large de nationalités, de femmes, de par le fait que j'ai vécu beaucoup de temps à l'étranger, je suis revenue il y a peu de deux ans, et j'ai vu ces femmes au fil du temps. Et donc, par le biais de Madame Naima Ramundi, elle m'a permis de pouvoir exprimer et montrer les toiles de femmes sur lesquelles j'avais travaillé. Voilà, elles sont très diverses. C'est bon <rire> Là, c'est une... Une, une femme qui a été prise par un photographe français, M. Michel Conrad. Et euh, j'avais vu cette, euh, cette photo, c'était une photo d'une femme assez euh, rétro, et euh, j'ai trouvé qu'elle avait beaucoup de charme. Donc j'ai voulu en faire le portrait, j'ai donc demandé l'autorisation à ce photographe de pouvoir la transposer sur, euh, en œuvre d'art. Alors en dessous, vous avez aussi un petit peu le reflet de la, de, de, de la femme française très chic avec un verre de champagne. C'est une œuvre que j'aime beaucoup. Elle est assez euh, insolente dans son regard. Ici, vous avez une femme japonaise. Ici, une femme éthiopienne d'Éthiopie. Ici, vous avez une femme d'Asie, plus particulièrement. Euh, la Chine, dans un bain d'eau de, chaude. Ici, vous avez euh, cette femme hein, que j'ai croisée à, au Japon, à Tokyo, dans un jardin. Je la trouvais très fière avec son petit, son petit bébé. Et Agatha, qui est une jeune fille que j'ai croisée dans un restaurant et euh, pour lequel j'ai demandé de faire des photos. Et euh, donc on a fait ça dans le jardin et là je l'ai mise en, en peinture. Voilà. Je crois vous avoir tout dit sur l'ensemble de mes œuvres qui sont là.